What's up guys and welcome back to Blanche vs Zombies Garden Warfare 2 and today we're gonna be going ahead and doing more Feast of Us stuff for you today. Of course, it's been a little while since we've done this a couple of days and I'm super duper sorry for that. I tried, I promise I tried my best but things just sort of blew up on me. But let's talk to Mr. Snowman again and see what he has in store for us today. You're back, ready for the next chess game? Yeah, of, of course, as soon as possible. All right then, so we got a key finder. Uh, we gotta find the key. So this way, we're already super close to it, apparently. So let's try going this way. I don't have my husk cop yet, so. Hey look, you look familiar. You're me, but you have different stuff on. I can hear it already. Let's get up here and, oh there it is, there it is, easy key, take it. Hey, that was super easy. <laughs> Maybe a little too easy, I'm not sure. But there we go, we get that opened up, and now there are zombies around. Hey zombies, let's get out of here. Let's get you out of here, come on, come on, come on, get out of here. And then let's open up the Christmas chest. What are we gonna get inside this one? It will be, ooh. It is the ornament head, and I think that's for the chomper? I'm pretty sure that's for the chomper. Or maybe this is Tron, it doesn't actually show you. So we're gonna go ahead and find out ourselves. I Maybe it is? It is for the situation, look at that. All right then, so, ooh, I, I really like that. I definitely wanna try that with the Isotron. Do we have any facial hairs that might work with that? Um, I am not sure. Uh, I don't really see too much at all. Yeah, I don't really think there's gonna be too much that really works with that. Uh, <laughs> maybe we'll do that. I don't know why, but I think it'll work. Now, is there anything that's not exactly Christmassy? But uh, I think what will really work is with the Isotron, so we'll probably play him today. Um, I just don't know if too much of this will really work too well, so I think we'll just keep it with the base, the Nun, and then we'll just keep it with that. Now let's also do that on Isotron. Nope, not what I wanted to do. Let's try that again on Isotron and see how it works there. I think it'll look really, really cool on him for some obvious reasons, but he's gonna be a Christmas Citron now, which is just as good. So basically, we just honestly, we could keep it like that, you know, with the Ice Beard, but I really like this curly beard. Like, I think that makes it pretty cool right there. <laughs> I think it's just something about it makes it sort of more Christmassy. So there we go, there is the, um, what's it, whatever this is called. Let's go ahead online and try to play a little bit with this Icy Tron and maybe a few other Citrons and just sort of show it off and have some fun. You know, this is a great excuse to get some levels as the Isotron, because I really, really need it. I just don't play this guy a lot, but look at how Christmassy he looks. He has a little hook there so you can hang it on the tree. That's so cool. I hope you guys, I mean, one that's being posted is like the day before Christmas. I hope you guys have been getting your awesome Christmas stuff, you know, done. You've been hanging stuff on your Christmas tree. Oh, there you go, look at you. You didn't have much health left to begin with then. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, you were so close there, buddy. So close. He had to be low. I almost froze him, I think, but not quite. But yeah, I don't know if there really will be too many other Citrons where this looks decent with. I mean, I, this is our perfect combo, so we'll probably be spending most of the episode today playing it with this guy right here. Let's go ahead and bada boom, hit you up like that. And then we're gonna go ahead and stun you, hopefully before this mech notices my existence. He noticed it. Oh gosh, come on, no, no, no. Okay, I gotta get the shield up. <laughs> that just did not work out. Might be like a one vanquish, one death kind of a uh, play style today. I hope not, because I know I can do better with Cistron, but we'll just try to enjoy it for a few points. Maybe then we'll switch to a different Cistron. Who knows? But my main focus will be playing it with this guy. Let's get up here if I can. Ooh, there you go, there you go, that was awesome. And then I'm gonna stun you, or miss it entirely. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, come on, freeze you, freeze you, freeze you, I got you frozen! Gotcha, nice, okay. Wanted to get out of there. It really is, one vanquish, one death, what is with that? I need to play better. And this is like my home turf, look at this. We're on freezy freeze land. Like I just blend in. Oh my God, I can just like sit right here. If I wasn't glowing orange, nobody would notice me. Let's go ahead and get you a little bit, freeze you, come on, can I freeze you? Can I freeze you? Oh jeez, they are just, they're all coming at me too, which doesn't help. Come on, can I get at least one more vanquish before? Come on, come on, yes, there you go. Two times vanquish streak. Was that so hard? I guess it was, ooh, okay. Who's popping up there? The uh, pea shooter got him. Can you heal me? Thank you. You're my favorite right now. Thank you for the help. I'm gonna get you a little bit, as much as I possibly can. Try to get that freeze happening. Come on, come on, come on. Ah. Maybe I can get you. Just trying to freeze whoever we can. Like I feel like other people have such an easy time freezing people, but I never really end up getting it too much. Come on. Ah, oh, did I get him there? 
No, he's not alive anymore. <laughs> he's just sitting up there. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Gotcha, there's times three, and I'm down. But hey, that's a good start, that's a good change of pace there. Let's see if we can't get, like, I don't know. What level are we right now with the Ice Tron? Level five and a half. Let's see how close we can get to level 10 in this map. That would be a nice little challenge, just because of the fact that if I can get another t level 10 upgrade as a Citron, that's just like a little bit more, you know, progress in the right direction. I wanna see that happening. Okay, stop it. Stop it right now. <laughs> yeah, I'll throw that down there, and then I'm gonna try to land it. No, this is not working. I'm just gonna wait. I'm gonna get back, I wanna find some reinforcements, and I'm gonna wait it out. You guys looking for golden gnomes? I found them all, don't worry. Let's see, uh... Okay, here you are. Yep, waiting for you. Bada boom, got you good. And then hop out of here, and then, oh, I thought I had my impeach. I swear it just said a second ago it was ready. Weird. Okay. Ooh, come on, come on, come on. I'm just trying to shoot him. I'm missing wildly. Oh boy, but I still got the vanquish. I still got the vanquish. Let's try to get up here and everything. But yeah, since I've missed a few days of Feastivus, I would love to hear any updates on what you guys have been up to, like what kind of Feastivus items you've been getting, what's your Feastivus, your favorite Feastivus item so far? You know, all that kind of cool stuff. I do plan on showing off at least the remainder of the festive edition Feastivus hats because I think we're about halfway through them. I know we did show off the Colonel Corn one, the Chomper one, and then a few others, so I will be doing that. Yeah, come on, can we get you, can we get you? Let's go ahead and do that. Where's the super brains at? I have no clue. So instead, I'm just gonna try to freeze the mech. Cause if we could freeze the mech, that's a really good situation. I got an assist. So you know what, that's decent. Hmm, where are you at? You were trying to run? Well, let's get you. Ooh, I'm landing those headshots. Like I just, the thing is with this character is that of course you're doing less primary weapon damage, but the chances of freezing are what sort of replaces that. You know, the idea is that, you know, you might not get as much damage out, but the chances are you're gonna be able to freeze them and get some free hits on them. But I end up freezing people so rarely that it's just like, it's not a good trade-off. So it's just, it's a weird class. It's never been that great for me. I know a lot of people who love the Iron Citron, though, or not Iron, Ice Citron, the Frozen Citron, something like that, you know, you know. Here. Let's try to get across to here. Whoa! <laughs> All right, that worked out pretty well. All right, can we get you before you realize I'm here? No, of course not. Well then I'm just gonna EMP tune, or not. Oh, come on. Where are you, where are you, where are you? You're running. These guys are really good at running away, I'll tell you that much. They're really good at being a coward. Where'd you go? You're over here now. Okay, well, at least your vanquished imp body is over here. Can we get you a little bit? We're not landing too much on guys like this. Oh, he's frozen, finally, I get somebody frozen. Nobody else was there to attack him. That's where it's really good. It's like frozen classes can be great against mechs because then it's like, it encourages teamwork. You know, you can freeze them and the rest of your team will just focus them down in that amount of time. But nobody was around for that one, no were they? <laughs> Christmas Citron, you're letting me down. <laughs> Let's get across to here. And, uh, ooh, come on. No, oh, I messed that up. Messed it up big time. Boom, let's get that ready. Come on, destroy him, destroy him, destroy him. We got the ice frozenness. Yeah, there we go, level six for me. It doesn't look like we're making great progress towards level 10, but you know what, we're trying, we're trying. Oh boy, oh boy, come on, get you, get you, get you, get you, get you, get you. Oh, you gotta be frozen soon. Man, if I could actually land the shots on. That's something, if you're horrible at the game, you ain't gonna do too great with it. Well, I guess that's sort of the case for every class, but you never know. All right, he's actually wearing another one of the uh, Feast of His, uh, Festive Edition hats, that all-star. I think, I'm pretty sure it is. It's basically what we have, but broken. Like, ours is nice and tidy and like, well, you know, designed, but the all-stars is all like just broken on his head. So you know what? I think we did a better job. We wore it better, as they say. All right then, so I'm gonna sneak on over here and try to poke you a little bit. I wasn't able to poke you. Who can I poke? I gotta be able to poke somebody here. Come on, poke you a little bit. Okay, how do you know I'm here? Get out of here, stop shooting at me. Oh boy, this is probably not where I'm supposed to be. Okay, I'm out of here, see ya. <laughs> oh, that was great. I just zoomed on him, nobody's getting me. Nobody's gonna mess with this zebra, or this Christmas citron, or whatever. That's uh, I like to see that people are spawning in ice rooms, if not just to fit the times, you know? Probably not though, they're probably spawning in for the fact that it, you know, it helps with uh, playing the game or something like that. All right, let's try to get you. No, nope, not gonna work. Ooh. We probably will, I mean, 
Of course, for Lawn of Doom, you might have known that at the end of the Lawn of Doom event, they released a pack that you could purchase to buy the rest of the Lawn of Doom items just in case you weren't able to get them during the gameplay. So, with that being said, chances are that'll happen to us again. I really hope that you know there is a Feast of His pack that we can purchase and earn up those sweet, sweet you know, exclusive customizables while they're still around. If that's the case, I'll probably do like a little spending spree on that like I did the Lawn of Doom pack and hopefully we can get up, end up getting all of the Feast of His items because I'd hate to miss some. Okay, let's, oh, oh no, oh no, 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 no. Come on, gotcha, gotcha good. That didn't land on anybody. So I didn't get that person good. Ooh, it's Ice Glass versus Ice Glass. He's getting away. I'm gonna poke around this side, this corner. I have no idea where that, that soldier went, but trying to mess with other people now, okay? There's one person at a time. One person at a time. Oh, I got you a little bit, no! Darn it, well there comes the mech. Get you a little bit if I can. No, don't get in your bucket or your barrel. <laughs> it ain't a bucket. That's a silly of me. All right, let's get out of here real quick because they're gonna try to take this point. We got double parties this round over there, that's pretty cool. Yeah, there's no way I'm reaching level 10. This is just too difficult for me apparently. I'm just like, how many, I got 12, which really isn't anything super impressive. Maybe I could start changing that around, but it's these kinds of classes that are gonna make it super tough for me to reach you know, the max level in this game, because I'm just not good with them, no matter what I do. No amount of practice seems to change it. Come on, come on, come on, I know you're almost down. Oh, come on, how much health can you have? Too much, too much health. That's definitely the, the case right there. Totally not my fault, it's everybody else's. Okay then. Well yeah, it's Christmas Eve when this video is going up, so I hope you guys are you know, doing cool stuff, either be chilling at home like I choose to do, or maybe you're out with family on vacation, something crazy cool like that. Be free to let me know first of all, and you know, let me know how's it going. Is it going good, is it going not so good? I hope it's going good, because I like to sort of keep it up with the zebra herd and knowing that they're doing good. Okay, this is not gonna work. <laughs> I'm not doing so good at the moment, but in general I'm doing okay. I'm gonna survive. I mean, to be honest, this year Christmas sort of came really quickly, and I have a feeling it's gonna go really quickly. I mean, after tomorrow, you know, it's gonna be just sort of regular old life again, right? Well, we'll have the new year, and I'm like, yay, 2017, and then that'll be it. It'll just be like any other holiday season. You know, it's it's came and then it went. So, I really don't know how to feel about it. Holidays are weird, in my opinion. Like, this, the concept of holidays can be weird when you think about it. Maybe that's just me. Maybe I'm just a weird zebra. I just don't understand these human tendencies. <laughs> All right, then where are the zombies at? I'm trying to look for zombies here. Apparently, oh, there's a few over here because they got the teleporter set up, duh. Okay, you're getting smacked. Yeah, I told you you're getting smacked and got smacked, what do you know? It's not a surprise, dude. Oh, you got double smacked, the poor dude. Not his day, not his day. All right, let's get up here. And then, uh, yep, there you go. I hope that a lot of new people end up getting Garden Warfare 2 for Christmas, though. I mean, I know the game's been out for like 10 months now, so most people who want to get it probably, probably have ended up getting it, but I also know that, you know, sometimes people are late to the party. That doesn't mean they can't join it, you know? So hopefully we see a lot of new people playing Garden Warfare 2. A lot of people sort of see that as a bad thing for some reason. Like, if they play, there'll be more noobs in the game or something like that. Like, how's that a bad thing? One thing, easier vanquishes for you. Second thing, more people playing the game guarantees that it's going to be a game for longer, you know? If nobody played this game, I'm pretty sure that they would stop supporting it. So, you know, the more the merrier. No need to be so close-minded about it. All right, who's attacking me here? Cause I'm pretty sure somebody's attacking me. Let's get rid of this imp. Freeze him, freeze him, freeze him. Okay, there you go, he got frozen midair. He was just stuck there for a few moments. Can we get you? No, okay, there you go, it's all done. So maybe in the next few rounds, or yeah, the next round, we will try to play some other Citrons, take a look at the item there, and, and just sort of see how things go. One thing I didn't notice is that tattoos seem to be per class for the Citron. Like, Electro Citron right here only has three of them, but the normal Citron here has like a ton of them. What is with that? That's actually really weird, I've never seen that before. What about, now I'm curious, did we miss out on any Cool opportunities here for the Ice Citron. Not really, I mean, this is still the best fit, I think. This doesn't look too bad, but it doesn't really make it look super Christmassy. Either way, we're gonna be going ahead and playing a little bit of the Electro Citron. Another Citron I really need to level up, but I'm not so great with this guy, so. <laughs> Let's just hope it works out. Well, I guess I'm using the Space Ball. Didn't even realize, that's okay. You know what, it's, it's, it's white colored, so it's sort of, you know, the shade of Christmas. <laughs> As they say, the, a white Christmas, right? When it snows. 
something like that. All right, let's go ahead and try to peck at you a little bit. No, you don't. Yeah, I thought so. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna charge you. No, I charged right over you. Okay, let's charge up and smack this dude or miss entirely. One of those two things are gonna happen. So let's hope it's a good one. Okay, I feel like he's been changed. I feel like he might have been nerfed when Frontline Flats released, but I can't remember. Oh, yeah, I think he did. I don't know, maybe I'm going crazy. Because I thought these did 20 damage a shot, but maybe I'm going crazy with that. Like, I don't know. <laughs> maybe I was crazy to begin with, who knows. Hmm. Let's uh, get you. There's a triple vanquish for us so far though. That's actually pretty nice. Like sometimes I'm great with this class, sometimes I'm utterly horrible with it. It's just really trying to land those shots. Yeah, I landed on something there, I don't know what. Here, you know what, no. And then, oh, you still got me there. Okay, there we go, times five right now, this is beautiful. Oh, that was good. Come on, come on, come on. Peek back over here, dude. Come on. Ah, oh, you little butt. There you go, times six now. So many super brains. Why so many? Like, this is too much. I don't need so many in my life. Okay, I'm gonna back it up, back it up, back it up, back it up, back it up. Flee from the situation. There you go. And then I'm gonna, ooh. Or not. <laughs> I tried to get Mr. Goat over here. It's not working out perfectly. Hey, no, 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 watch out, watch out, watch out, watch out, watch out, move! Move, you dingus! <laughs> come on! Oh, yes, that was good. Got it. Oh, come on, he's so low. I'm gonna get up there, I'm gonna take care of business then. Oh, I might not be able to, actually. <laughs> I'm trying to. Get up like that. Come on, just get on the roof! Get on the roof! Is this really that difficult for you? Thank you, and he's not even up here anymore. My struggles, they're real. Okay, who's doing that? Who's doing that? Ooh, that was good. That was a really good shot. All right, got you there, and then, oh, that almost got you. Come on, come on, finish him off, finish him off. I know he's low, mm-hmm. Ooh, got you there. It just, it's super hard to l l like land the shots, but once you do it, mm, it feels so great. Like, I don't know why I'm doing so well, particularly right now, but it's working, and I'm not gonna complain. And you get that splash damage a little bit too, but if you get that direct hit, that's what you really want. Whoa, I just barely dodged that ZPG. That was a little close for comfort. Um, who's there to really hit around here? Um, well, I'm just gonna shoot it down here. Oh, and I got that splash damage to hit somebody there, or something. There you go. Okay, wow, that splash damage is actually insane right now. One more time, one more time, one more time. Oh, there you go, cool stuff, cool stuff indeed. And then, let's go ahead and get you like that, and then like that, and I'm just landing a few shots, and that's really making a huge difference, and we're playing great right now. I'm proud of this. Like, I've never done this well as like any Citron, well, hold the Electro Citron here. Got you there, there's a time, so we got the double digits! Yeah, <laughs> and we're moving on to 11. Oh my, oh my. Everybody like is playing Super Brains right now. They're all trying to land that Super Ultra Ball. And I ain't letting it happen. There's another one for us. Just keep racking up the numbers. 12 Vanquish Streak for the 12 days of Christmas. What do you know? Come on, come on, come on. Ooh. There you go, there you go. It was sort of okay. Um, I should probably back up, actually. So let's finish you off while I do so. Don't you call on your mech. Don't do it. Oh, I was too late because I had to stink and reload. Well, then I'm gonna back it up just a little bit and we're just gonna charge up and let this rip, and then if you're gonna attack me, then I'm gonna peace out because I don't wanna deal with losing my streak. Come on, yeah, you're gonna help me continue my streak. Don't you dare, don't you dare, don't you dare. Yeah, I thought so. You're trying to charge up your punch there. Ain't happening, ain't happening at all. Ooh, that was good. Plucked him out of the air a little bit. Hey now, hey now, hey now. There you go, times 15. This might be one of my longest like vanquish streaks ever. Like, I mean, I've had like, I think 25 is my max, so if I could get 10 more, that'd be pretty crazy. I don't know if that's gonna happen, but I just need to make sure if anybody's like at my doorstep, I need to just run. Like, don't fight them, just run. <laughs> Ooh, that was good! Man, it's just waiting for them. This is such a great map for it, too. So there's like a lot of long range opportunities. And it's just like not being afraid to let it go. Like, don't dilly dally. Like, if you think they're about to move, let it rip and just let it hit them, because it's like, I'd rather it do the 40 damage than the 70 damage as long as it's gonna land, because if I miss it, then it's doing zero. 
So let's try to get over here. Um, I don't actually see any zombies right now, so this game is about to end, though. I can't believe I've like I've gotten every vanquish so far. I've gotten without dying. I am like not finding anybody to properly hit though, so I need to be careful. Okay, this guy's gonna try to come for me. Uh, ready? No. No, come on, get back here. What are you doing? I, I'm losing my touch. I lost my groove. No, my groove. I need it back. <gasps> Give it to me. I demand it. Who are you being up? I guess I guess it was a toxic citron over there. Okay, I got that. That was pretty good. What are you doing? What are you doing? You do realize I have that. There you go, there's 17. Good stuff, good stuff right there. Okay, not good, not good, not good. Back it up, back it up. Don't get hit by that if you can manage. Ooh, gotcha, there is gonna be times 18, I think? Insane right now, this is intense. Like I talk about some stuff while I'm doing this, but I'm trying to just focus on it. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Whoa, 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 whoa. No, 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 back it up, back it up, 16 health. Okay, I'm gonna get out of here, I wanna flee, flee the situation. <laughs> Come on, come on, come on, can I get 19 or 20? Nah, okay then. What a game, I had to get Top Vanquisher then. Definitely Top Vanquisher. I'm gonna be super mad if I didn't get Top Vanquisher in Vanquish Street. <laughs> We're about to find out though, because we just dominated that game. Very cool, I've never done that well as a Citron before. How many coins did we get? We got, eh, okay, okay, that's better. 11,000 is pretty good for as short of a game that was. Top Vanquisher, Top Vanquish Street, almost 20 in one life, that's pretty darn good. So here's a look at the ornament head on every single Citron that I own. I think it's a really cool hat and it looks the best on the Frozen Citron, but of course I think that we wear it best on the Electro Citron just because we played so darn well and I've never done that as a Citron or let alone an Electro Citron I'm usually particularly bad at. So that was a lot of fun. Hopefully I can see myself getting more games like that done. Here it is on the Party Citron. It looks a little weird, but it almost looks fitting. You know, like that, just that plain white mixed in with the color. This honestly isn't too bad. Color scheme wise, I like it. So overall, this is a good item that sort of looks good with all of the characters. But the, thank you guys so much for watching. How many rainbow stars we have? Two, okay then, I was gonna say maybe we could open up the 10 Rainbow Star Mystery Chest, but instead what I'll do is I'll go ahead and try to buy some of the remaining items that we still need from Rux, because I need to keep doing that. I need to keep in fashion with that. So we have uh, almost 400,000 coins, so let's see what we can buy from him right now. Probably won't be anything super duper crazy, but it's always worth checking what we can get. Um, right now we got the Psyche Out, go to one for one classic item, the Scanner, go to one for one classic item, the Infinite Space Toaster, and of course the Scrumptious Baby Bond, two items from um, Infinity. So we're gonna go ahead and buy those just because of the fact that they're hard to get if you can't get the Infinity items. Um, of course, what's it called? In Infinity Time, this is like your next best bet, so. I'm gonna go ahead and do that, and then I only have enough for one more, so let's go ahead and do the psych out. I just wasted all my cash, but it was worth it, so it wasn't actually a waste. What do you know? So with that being said, thank you guys so much for watching today's episode of Plants vs. Zombies Garden Warfare 2. If you enjoyed it, make sure to give this video a like, share it with your friends and family, and of course, comment in the comment section below. If you watched this point of the video, make sure you comment Zebra Ornament, so I know you've watched in the video, and that you are a Zebra-tastic viewer. But by the way, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.